the university test to take this opportunity to leave this August gathering of leadership committee 2021 per head. This is the first of its kind in the history of our party. So, to go with the sequence of our program, program may I call up uh, Sir Akolere to invoke God blessing.
to welcome our distinguished guest, Speaker Mr. L. Dico, Minister for PhED and Stationery, Government of Manipur, this evening to Kohima. I also take this opportunity to welcome the respected motivational speakers, Engineer Lagusan Sam, General Secretary COB, ICCYW, Mr. Achuna Mokikon, Secretary General, NPF, and Mr. Wayam Yolo, MLA, Nagaland State. On behalf of the NPF Central Ukraine, I warmly welcome all the delegates from various parts of Northeast India to this leadership meet at Kohima on NPF Catalyst for Peace. Over the years, there has been a growing desire for peace in our uh, society. Political leadership and the need for participation in conflict resolution have become the need of the hour. The NPF has therefore assumed a leadership role in a guest for permanent peace as the party has taken it upon itself to become a catalyst for peace. Towards this end, a number of meetings and subsequent resolution gave the way for meaningful participation in the peace process. The party is now playing an important role as facilitator and mediator in peace related issues. We thus hope to establish a stable, secure, and peaceful Naga society in the near future. With these few words, I once again warmly welcome all of you to this leadership meeting. Thank you. Naga people's front, Central Office, Naga Puyma. Greetings. My dear NPF Ukraine leaders, on behalf of the party and all on my own behalf, I send greetings to the Ukraine leaders on the occasion of your holding leadership lead today at Kohima. We are proud member of the only regional party that represents the identity and personality of the people of Naga Land. The only party that survived against all odds because our ideology and principle are deeply rooted in the unique history of Nagaland. A kingdom remains square when its army is strong. So also, NPF will remain square as long as our Ukraine remains strong. Remember that truth prevails at the end always. I wish you all the best of luck for the grand success of the meet. Dr. Shazir Zizu, President of the People's Crown, Dele Poima, in November 2021. Thank you. Almighty, for bringing all of us here today, without which we would not have been today. It is my privilege being part of the NPA family, the privilege of being in the youth, you will know, which is the powerhouse of the party, through which the came of brothers from Nagaland, Manipur, Assam, Arunachal Pradesh, and Myanmar have been British. Appreciate the Naga leaders striving hard to bring an amicable solutions to our Naga political issue. And our senior political leaders leading from front with their wisdom, guiding and warning us in every way. I once again appreciate the Central Ukraine for organizing this youth meet, a platform where we can understand each other better and exchange our thought. Long live NPF, Kumnali. General Secretary, Central Women Wing, bring warm greetings for the Central Women Wing team, especially to the Central Women team, under the leadership of Mr. N. Dimoshes. The Central Women Wing team congratulate the Central Ukraine team on successfully convening and organizing this two-day leadership summit. 
I would also like to take this opportunity to thank the Singapore Philippine team for inviting the, the Women Wing team to be part of this grand program and wish the Central Philippine a very success, grand success of this program and also in all your future collective endeavors. Thank you, God bless, long live and give. Good evening to everyone. Yeah, the organizing committee, NPS Central European for Leadership 2021, would like to give a small token of our love and appreciation to our program dignitaries. So, while I call your names, sir, please uh, stand on your feet and receive our gifts. First of all, I will call our guest speaker, honorable minister, Mr. Henry Paul. Minister for PCT and Printing and Stationery.
is privilege to me and I'm honored to be here. Like I said, I won't take long and give a better time to the speakers. When we see our program, programs arrangement in today's program, especially the motivational speakers, the sequence taught me something. Usually, Mohan Lagaban Nangu Gathering, now you can meet him there The junior ones Or the amateurs Itu kane, Oila Kota Mungo Aru Tade If something wrong is said The elderly, wiser ones Wise men Tade, which they need to go in as a family Aru, if there is some shock falling, the elderly people, they come up for a reason. So maybe our organizers get the third call and give it in that space. So I'm confidently standing here. Whatever I misspell or if they fall short, definitely they'll come up. Like I said, this direction itself is a culture of our letters. And we are all letters. And truly, we are maintaining the identity, the uniqueness of our letters. Today, we are speaking about another solution, settlement. Here I want to tell you, these are all of We say we are unique, we are different, yet, like I said, everything is political. Our brothers and sisters, we are all in different parties. I don't say that other political parties are there. They are not equally good. There are many principles, ideologies, principles. It's all good. But it is in general. Coming to our Naga context, specifically, this Naga people's front is for the best. So, when we try to claim our rights and views, when you shy away from the very name that they have in you, you know that among you. You name yourself as Bharatiya something party. You name yourself Democratic something party. You name yourself Janata something. With that, when we approach, where is your Nagate? I think, coming to our Nagate next, the NPF is the right platform where we can make ourselves known to the world. And I think the party men and women enrolled here and working here are the true patriots. Yes, we are in opposition now. At least here in London, not in London, of course. Your friends and neighbors and the government facilities can think you enjoy your life. But all this law, it do the lucrative things which are temporary. It do have made a rule or the rule of the up. Party that is strongly firm when I lay a party up on the road. Instead of me motivating you, you're motivating me. This is very good. Let's give it up. Our friends, they may be in different, different political party. But like I said, if we want a permanent solution and for another cause, invite them, make them understand. Tell them, you can shy away the name Nagas. And this is the only political party now. 
So, medium to come into our form, rather medium be with us, so we do something for our people. But in doing so, in inviting them or making them understand, let us be reminded what Ferry said. The six behaviors which characterize a skilled politician. It is a very elaborated study, but in order to touch on, let me just point out the points which you all know, but let us be reminded what Ferris found in this research. To be a political skill, politically skilled, the six points are thinking before speaking, itself is self-explanatory, they may not go further. The second is managing up, that is managing the situation. And third one is interpersonal influence. Fourth one, social testimonies. The fifth one is networking. And the last one, but not the least, which is very important, is the sincerity. Even if I don't explain, it serves as a certain So, let's all keep all of those things in our mind. And, as I said, to strengthen the party, we are all very firm, big hit, and let's all invite our friends, our fellow brothers and sisters of Nagas to be our, in our party. Explaining them, telling them our vision, and while we so, keeping these four points in our mind, let's venture out. Like I said, I won't take much time and give time to our speakers and to me. Let's be attentive and listen to them. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, the President has sent 
you a very wonderful greetings with a lot of message which has been read to all of us. I'm um, so it. it was a very encouraging message. I would like to try a little bit. I want to connect the story that I have read. Either positively or either negatively, we are motivated. The provision for us to speak, three of us, my friend, Lopez, myself, and Amaro Bayo, you have mentioned motivation now, motivation speech. I don't know how to be motivated. But the story that I have narrated in our life, either we are positively motivated or negatively motivated. The other brother was negatively motivated, so he became a drunken man because his father was a drunken man. The other brother decided, no, I cannot be a drunken man like my father. So both of them throw their motivation from their father. But the other one took it positively, the other one took it negatively. This is how our life grows. So also in politics, what motivates you to join NDF? What motivates you to become an NDF? Apakah tak terlalu tentu kita buat? You all are leaders. No matter where you are, in your own, in your own way, in our own way, we all are leaders. You may be as a youth leader in your own area, institution, or in your divisions, or in the division, in the central level. It doesn't matter. There are people behind you. That's why you are there. Now, what motivates you to join a party and to become a leader? And how you are motivating the people who are behind you, thousands of followers who are behind you? You are president, general secretary. Lots of designations being given to you from the central office. In no way we can take it lightly. Well, there are people behind you. There are people looking at your leadership, and as much as the two brothers looking at their father. So also there are people who we are fathers in our own way. So therefore, dear comrades, in which way we are motivated to join this party? This party was formed on the 21st of October 1963 when there were a lot of turmoil, confusion in the Naga society. Now, our leaders, they came together and they have formed an idea that we need to form a party which can relate, which can transcend beyond our own narrow tribal feelings, our own narrow individual interests, and we must come together to form this party in order to ensure that Nagas find its rightful place in this whole universe. Towards this endeavor, this party has already a day. It has milestones in the past 15 years. It has a day 58 years. In this past 58 years, what this party has done? You have chosen the theme NBF dash Academies for Peace and a chain for peace in simple words. How we have been contributing this party towards building peace in our society, not only confining to the Nagas alone, but reaching out to the Northeast, to our neighboring communities, as well as to India as a nation. This party has contributed immensely, immensely, in building peace in bridging the gap amongst the various communities in bringing understanding. And don't you feel fortunate to be a part, be part of that party that has built peace, that has brought an understanding amongst the various communities? We should feel fortunate and we should, we should feel encouraged by such activities that this party has put in in the past 58 years. So after forming the party, our party initially was called Democratic Party of Naga TBN, with the roster as a symbol. In the rural areas, it is more to do with 
Morga party and Kok party. We are known as Kok party. Officially, yes, we are also here, but in a simple Musti Manolaka language, as a Morga Laka party. Now, in 1964, the election was conducted because the state group was formed with the 16 point agreement in 1960, Indian period for, for about three years then. This Nagar state was created on the, officially in order on the 1st of December 1973, so followed by the election sometime in January 1964. Our party with this box circle, of course, the nomenclature was at that point of time as the Democratic Party of Nagar. We fought the election and our party won 12 seats. At that time, the Nagar state was only 40, had only 46. So out of 46, we won 12. Now, the 12 of them, the whole objective of this party was to bring the Nagar national workers. We call it in a simple, uh, in a common part, uh, in a common understanding, Nagar Nagarans. Well, that's not a very distinct term, but we call it Nagar national workers. Nagar national. That was the interior of this party to bring the Naga national workers and the government of India to a negotiating table. So our party, the 12 of the them, the 12 members, moved a resolution in the assembly and a resolution was passed, supported by the ruling, because we were only 12 who were in the position. And the resolution was passed that a peace mission should be constituted to ensure that we bring our underground friends and the government of India were negotiating there. In the meantime, the Northern Baptist Church Council was also making an effort <coughs> in the form of constituting a peace mission comprising of Reverend Prakash Narayan, Reverend Michael Scott, and Kili Chali. So these three gentlemen from outside the Nagar communities were brought in, and along with that, the effort of our 12 MLS, the this file was signed, which was which came into effect on the 6th of September 1964. After that, what happened? That year itself, election was sometime in the first week of uh, January 1964. Then the if you see the sequence, then in September 1964, the six file was issued, and by December. Our 12 MLAs resigned in Rome because of the fact that we have achieved what we have to do. Our whole objective of contesting the election in 1964 with the main Democratic Party of Nagaland. Anybody's situation there, Nagaland, Amina India, composition, Vaigana, is it really Nagaland? Central youth being brought in about organized school in the Okolina, what he can have. I have no program as a Nolina of Nagar, you see, you see, by Jen. He do. I mean, you don't think that when Oblimo has said, in the air, talk simple to Nagar political issue, Ghana, Nihan, Malik, Nihan, but I have not brought up. India has been to be present Nakalin the opposition is forming Bonavo Naga Sulus Nahiko in the day or Amigan Isi Pushinaira Nakalin the opposition is Arnold Bonagana Amar Boy Pai Kano to go there. State politician Amahati Milay was here, Abni Hanti Milay, Naga Public Kana Isi Kano, Bonagana, Taikano to be to Mrs. Puti. Naga Batman, unfortunate Ekta Atha Nagalinde, Atha Mayan Maja, Organjande, Mani Pore, Sok Chagade, Pak Purigina, Anigan, unfortunate Kilche Naga generation, Putra Pimo Purigina, Anigan Nagaku, Pakta situation there. Last will be four or five years. Naga souls in the very top of the island. India. Having India, 
Jangan pernah. Asal pun mau bukannya, so bukan tak boleh. Ibu ni ni dah kena oksigen fix kuli nak rakan di sana. Asal orang ekonomi lebih turun pun ini dah amat ramai dalam hari. Ibu pun berjaya di sana juga. Animan Party last fifteen years. Ani tak kami tu India tak hebat lah tu. Last election kami yang lebih lebih macam ni saya India tak hebat lah ni. India pasal tu apa? Amni kan tu amni bersu junior kan asal. Indo. Amni kan last fifteen years nak apa ni tu tu? Kamu yang tu tu mesti kini farmer bela tu tu tu. Amni kan. हाल बात हो लुई जान है ना अमीन बाबी बाबर के किन्तु आरो नागालैंड में बोलने को पार्टी किसे आते किन्तु इंडिया ऐसा होता हो नागालैंड में डीपी रुदर तो इंडिया बसु इधर पार्टी का आपने ऑफिस पे रह सके इधर पार्टी का आपने मिले रह सके अमीन का की पूरी दिन का फ्यूचर नागा चिमेशु किन्हें बात हो जाओ Naga manusian kali seratus ni terai, ha? Satu, awal awal zaman ni eram sixty thousand asa, mami buat ni eram sixty thousand ni dua ya asa, mekali ada eram sixty thousand ni dua ya asa, naga ni ni wala forty thousand apa apa asa, seratus ni juga mana? Itu lah problem dah makan dua ya asa. India thala dua ya kan? Noelle ini dia kan? Noelle PJB ini dia dia kan? Ini dia plan untuk apa untuk nalar? Kira? Oposisi ini sekarang ni mau apa lah? Tapi kan ni ni jom, amar ni jom baru masuk. Ami kan bola ini ni itu hantar ke India. Am amar India ni korang tu kau yang pergi beli ni. Amar kan lah kan ni. Walau tak sokong kita ni apa? सरली काम करो इधर वाले फिर से नागा फिर नागा लोग जाओ खाने को तीन या बार फांस के बारे में लेमिट देते आसे इधर लेमिट है लास्ट 1962 का आजीवन काम नागा लेकर लगा फिर फंडिंग सिस्टम पूरा और और इंडिया चेंज हो गया इसलिए इधर लेमिट है इंडिया आमाका जूत खाने Ami kan lima naik ke atas itu kan berapa? Kalau faham tak tu? Sistem jenis tu lama lagi, itu faham tak tu lama lagi? Nakal yang ada tu mau berapa? India pasal naik ni sisi ciri bersuara hari ni. Tadi visa ni sana, mama tu ni sana, cik ni ni sana, orang nak esy jambian bumi si itu kan so boleh jadi. Aji, abang kan tinggi kan abang kan kalian terlibat. ताई अभी बहुत बोले तो दूसरा चेंज करी तो आमिर खान की होता है मेरे ओपन में होए एमएम होता है मिनिस्टर ओपन में होए आमिर खान लगा भी चेंज होगा तो यदि कोई के ना था आमिर खान एक दिन तो बुरी हो इन दो आमिर खान आमिर बुरी तारीफ बोले की बुरी बोला गया एवरेज प्रिपेयर तो इतना इतना कार्य अनुचित सीजू सीजू आने का भय है एक चुंबित एक चुंबित विशाल स्लाइड एक चुंबित एक चुंबित मसाल को तो बोले इन्हीं का और एक चुंबित एक चुंबित बोलूँ ना इन्हें बात करने के लिए तो लोग एक चुंबित एक चुंबित विशाल स्लाइड के नाम आने का निला निला ही था
Praise God. Before I entered politics, I was an entrepreneur. I initiated some entrepreneurship initiative. People want to listen to some of my initiatives. So I was invited this way, I remember, from 13 years ago. And uh, I spoke about the uh, leech army in Naga society. Everybody was cutting the hair. And uh, some people like to vomit also. Nobody was, I mean, uh, it was not very impressive, I believe. So nobody could take up that uh, leech farming initiative in Nagaland. And even myself could not take up. So I joined politics. So today, I, when I turned to this poll, I remember the day. So life is really, really interesting. God is great. I was I'm impressed to see our Honorable Emily and our Secretary General wearing a shawl like a Gambora, speaking with authority in this platform. It is a uh, great sign of uh, our culture, our tradition. We don't have uh, time to see this kind of uh, Naga culture in money, in money, especially in uh, most of the time. But of course we also see in the villages when elder, elderly men stood up with a shawl on his shoulder and pronounced or advised or suggest we respect and we honor. So today seeing this wonderful culture, we have a high level or great culture. I thank God for this beautiful day. And I give my honor to our honored Emily, our Secretary General, all the esteemed leaders on the stage, and all the esteemed party leaders and the youths of MPF. I on behalf of the Manipur State MPF must congratulate you for making this program to come together and share our common goal. And especially it is a very very important time for all of us but more important for the Manipur State to make us very sure by our mosquitoes. NPF is a beautiful party. Today, I would like to share how important is NPF in the human society. Today, youths are the backbone of our society and in our party too. So they, I would like to congratulate, appreciate and give a celebration to the NPF Youth Leadership for initiating this program when our party needs the most, the youth and especially the Manipur State Party. Elections are approaching, and this time the election in Manipur is going to be very, very tough because people have recognized MPF very nice. MPF have proof. It's vision and objective in Manipur people started appreciating India in many ways because 
we, even though we are not that great, but with all our shortcomings, limitations, we try to prove ourselves that we are another people's firm with a different vision and with a particular character which nobody, no other political party has. We are committed to our vision, the cost of our mother issue, rival in others, and also the tribal. And most importantly, we want to live with all the community in our states, wherever we are, whether we're in Nagaland, or in Omnacha, or in Manipur, we want to bridge the gap between communities and we want to live together in peace. NPF is a peace party party and NPF is a faithful party of our faith, which is very, very good for us. We have not seen any political party in other states who pronounce with our faith, who always pray when we start meetings, who always pray in the name of Christ when we go to meetings and we practice and we believe, we profess. Therefore, today, people came to know that MPF is a good party, it's, it's, a, it's a peaceful, love, peace loving party, and they have a us. Today, we are in the opposition in Nagaland. In Nagaland, MPF has done so much, but it's because of our non commitment, I should say. We have to learn a lesson. But we can we always believe and we can foresee that our strength will grow and we will do much better in the near future. Today in Manipur, we can participate in our 60 houses, we can participate in only 11 constituencies where Nagas are made. So our role in one assembly is so typical, so difficult in one way. But with few of our strength, we have proved ourselves that MPF is a very important party. They need to bring understanding between communities in Manipur. We could restore peace atmosphere in Manipur. This is what we can claim today. Today, other communities, even the BTAs, the most advanced and the majority people of the community, they appreciate us. Our brothers from other communities like the East, they want to contest, they want to join and give, and they want to contest even in the your party in this recent, I mean the upcoming election also. They say that one point of time when we are branded with Naga, they say it is for Naga. But now they realize that Naga people's firm is for peace, development, and they feel that Naga people's firm speaks the truth for the right of the people and for the, for the better of all the uh, people in the state. So this part we have achieved. Today I would like to call upon our youth that as our former speaker said, let us be strong, let us be committed in our commitment, in our vision. To be an NPF is a very, very honorable, honorable position. With my experience in NPF, I joined politics for the first time. 
in India. And this is my nine and a half years in politics in India. I never dreamed of doing politics. But when NPF started launching in Manipur, and we have seen the vision and the commitment that Naga people are coming together and we want to bring peace and Naga solution in Naga period. That was very, very challenging and very impressive. I was invited to join the protest in India. Initially, I, I did not decide. Election was in March, but I took a decision in December 22nd. And we protested. We never criticize people. We tell them we have different ideology, we have different vision, and other people's friend. Want to bring this? We are not for the ruling or not ruling, we are all for another solution and want to bring this in mind. People say, you will not be able to join in the ruling. You have only nine another constituency. And you will not be elected. And if you don't join in the government, what is the point being in the ruling? You will not even be allowed to go inside the assembly hall. People will chase you away. This kind of uh, comment was there when we started in PFC, in PFU. All our campaign process was disturbed by people, but somehow people understand and all of us were elected, we participated. And slowly we suffered, but slowly we gain a position. Slowly people say, young people are good people, but they choose they are good people in their own party. They even say like that, the Congress during movie time. But finally they started appreciating us. And today who would believe that MP will be in the government? In 2017 election, again four came back and we were invited to be in the government. We saved the PGP government. We helped to form the government. We are very committed to our commitment. When they are in trouble, when they are not in position to form the government, we supported them to form the government, their blind chain, without any demand, without any condition. When they are in trouble, we back them up. This was our commitment, and we have been doing that. Now they realize that MPF has only one vision, and they are very committed. They will never waver. So we have been doing like this. And when we stand strong with our commitment, I want to tell you my experience, how I enjoy as an MPF family, as an MPF minister. I have been honored, and I am honored to be an MPF representative. Wherever I go, I proudly go. We know that we have some disadvantage in forming the government or running the government, yet the most important thing is in life is that our principles are and our respect. Therefore, today, let us commit ourselves very strongly. Let us not waver ourselves. I just want to, you all know, there are so many other people, Naga leaders, who stand strong in within life as in the principle of Naga people. Today, as a living example, our president, the President he never waver. And he is still within us. This is a living testimony for another political leader and for all of us, especially the youths. You have, we have a strong support, we have a strong support. So important for us. I have learned lessons from him. The prestige, the honor that he has, this is just because he is very strong in his principle. And so many of our leaders are like that. Let us follow them. So enjoyable. 
If you are strong, you have commitment. I did my first election. I said nothing different. I don't speak against my opponents. I don't speak about other party. But I said other people from a different party. We are coming to different vision. Whether you like it or not, you vote for us. So I got the, I got the best, uh, second highest margin uh, winning vote next to Ubobi. Next time I was in Ubobi, was so strong. In my second election too, I got the highest.